Hi, I'm Kweko, I'm a pharmacist. In today's video, I'm going to talk about one of the most amazing supplements that you can take for your overall well-being. I'm talking about omega-3 fish oils. Now, I'm sure you're already familiar with some aspects of it, but do you know why they are so beneficial, especially for your heart, the brain, the skin, and many more? Well, stick around because I'm going to explain seven key benefits of omega-3 fish oils along with the scientific evidence behind them. I will link some of the studies that I referenced for those of us that want to read a little bit further in the description below, so do well to check it out. Now, here are the seven benefits of omega-3 that I have picked up. Number one is that omega-3s may fight inflammation. Inflammation is a natural process our body uses to protect itself from infections, injuries, and harmful substances. It's like the body's defense mechanism. However, sometimes this inflammation can become a problem when it sticks around for too long or becomes too intense. It can start damaging healthy tissues and organs, leading to various diseases such as arthritis, asthma, diabetes, and even sometimes cancer. Now, here's where omega-3s come in. They have the power to fight excessive or long-lasting inflammation. They work by helping to regulate our immune system and reducing the production of molecules that promote inflammation, such as uh, cytokines and what we call eicosanoids. Now, a group of researchers looked at lots of different studies, about 68 of them, and combined all their results. What they found was that people who took omega-3 supplements had lower levels of markers that indicate inflammation in their bodies. Now, talking about inflammation, let's talk about rheumatoid arthritis, which is an immune disease that causes painful and chronic inflammation in the joints. Another group of scientists did a similar study by looking at data from 23 different research studies. They found that taking omega-3 supplements help people with rheumatoid arthritis. It reduced their pain and stiffness, making it easier for them to move and feel better overall. Number two, omega-3s may fight depression and anxiety. Now, depression and anxiety are common mental disorders that affect millions of people worldwide. You know, they can have negative impact on one's mood, motivation, energy levels, sleep, appetite, and the general quality of life. Omega-3s, especially EPA, have been shown to have anti-inflammatory and neuroprotective effects that may help improve mood and reduce symptoms of depression and anxiety. Number three, omega-3s may improve high eye health. Now, the retina is the light sensitive layer of tissue at the back of the eye that converts light into nerve signals for the brain to process. The retina contains a high concentration of DHA, which is a type of omega-3 fatty acid that is essential for its structure and function. Omega-3s may help protect the retina from damage caused by oxidative stress, inflammation, high blood pressure, and even diabetes. Now, researchers at Harvard Medical School conducted a study with over 38,000 women to understand the impact of omega-3 fatty acids on eye health, specifically age-related macular degeneration. They asked the participants about their eating habits, focusing on how much fish they consumed. The women were then followed for 10 years to track their eye health. Now, the study revealed that women who ate one or more servings of fish per week were 42% less likely to develop age-related macular degeneration compared to those who ate fish less than once a month. Number four, omega-3s may promote brain health during pregnancy and early life. The brain develops rapidly during pregnancy and early life and requires adequate amounts of omega-3s for optimal growth and function. Omega-3s, especially DHA, are crucial for the formation and maturation of brain cells and synapses, which are the connections between them. Now, omega-3s may help prevent or reduce the risk of neurodevelopmental disorders such as autism spectrum disorder, attention deficit hyperactivity, disorder and even cerebral palsy. This is backed by several studies which concluded that pregnant women who took omega-3 supplements had higher levels of DHA in their blood and breast milk and gave birth to infants with higher cognitive scores than those who did not take any of those omega-3 supplements. Now, I guess if you want smart kids, you can start by taking omega-3s during pregnancy, but not until you check with your doctor first. Now, with respect to the use of omega-3s for managing ADHD in children and young people, a systematic review of 16 randomized controlled trials was undertaken. The trials included a total of 1,514 children and young people with ADHD who are located to take omega-3 or 6 supplements or a placebo. Of the 16 studies identified, 13 reported favorable benefits on ADHD symptoms including improvements in hyperactivity, impulsivity, attention, visual learning, 
reading, and even short-term memory. Number four, omega-3s may reduce the risk of heart disease. Now, it is no secret that heart disease is the leading cause of death worldwide. It is caused by various factors that damage the heart and the blood vessels, such as high blood pressure, high cholesterol, inflammation, blood clots or arrhythmias, or what we refer to as irregular heartbeats. Now, omega-3s have been shown to have beneficial effects on several risk factors for heart disease. In one study called the Reduce It Trial, researchers enrolled over 8,000 patients who were at a higher risk of heart problems and had high levels of blood triglycerides. They assigned half of the study participants to receive 2 grams of Vasepa twice a day and assign the other participants a placebo, which was a pill filled with mineral oil. Now, Vasepa is the purified form of EPA or what we call the prescription grade omega-3s, as some people like to refer to it. Now, the results show a significant benefit of omega-3s over the placebo. The omega-3 reduced blood triglycerides, but more importantly, it reduced the number of heart attacks and strokes and the need for heart stenting procedures to open clogged arteries and even subsequently dead. Now, full disclosure, here, this study was actually funded, uh, sponsored by the drug company that made Vasipa. So some people may look at it skeptically, but I still think the results are valid because even subsequent meta-analysis of over 10 additional studies found that fish oil omega-3 supplement lowered the risk of heart attack and death from coronary heart disease. Number five, omega-3s can reduce the symptoms of metabolic syndrome. Now, metabolic syndrome is a group of health problems that when combined, raise the chances of developing diabetes, heart disease, and stroke. These problems including having excess fat around the belly, high blood sugar levels, high blood pressure, high levels of triglyceride, and low levels of the good cholesterol, the HDL. Omega-3s have been shown to have a positive effect on metabolic syndrome by tackling these various issues. So for instance, they can reduce inflammation in the body, making the cells more sensitive to insulin, preventing fat from building up in the liver, and even improving the function of blood vessels. A study that looked at the combined results of 14 different research studies found that taking omega-3 supplements can be helpful for people with metabolic syndrome. It led to improvements in several areas such as reducing waist size, lowering blood sugar levels, improving blood pressure, and decreasing triglyceride levels. Omega-3s may also support hair growth and thickness. Omega-3s may support hair growth and thickness by providing essential fatty acids and antioxidants that protect the hair follicles from damage and inflammation. In a 2015 study, researchers investigated the impact of omega-3 and omega-6 fatty acid supplements on hair loss with women with female pattern hair loss. They hired 120 participants in total, and half of them took the supplement regularly for six months, while the other half did not take anything at all. After analyzing the results, researchers found that the group of women who took the supplement had more hair in the active hair growth phase compared to women who did not take the supplement. This seems that the supplement seemed to have a positive effect on hair growth in those with female pattern hair loss. So high level overview of some of the benefits of taking omega-3 supplements. I hope you found some value in it. On your screen now is another video that I hope you may find interesting as well. Thank you for staying through. Stay blessed. Catch you on the next video.